that much of the sex trafficking was actually done by the UN and all these hot spots. Are you guys, were you the har arsonists and the firemen? This Ridley O sponsored by friends of BitcoinStore.com. Are you Dr. Kuman? Yes, I am. Oh, thank you. Uh, I guess I got a question for you. You're here to oppose sex trafficking today, and that's great. Uh, but you used to work for the UN, and I, I got an article here from The Guardian, and quotes Kofi Annan saying that, that much of the sex trafficking was actually done by the UN in all these hot spots. Are you guys, were you the har arsonists and the firemen? Who are you? It's Dave Ridley with RidleyReport.com. Well, I think what Kofi Annan was talking about there was the really very, very serious incidents of abuse that took place mm -hmm. in West Africa at a given point in time. And Kosovo uh, and at, Bosnia at and just about everywhere of, UN troops go. At the hands of peacekeeping troops. And there has been a tremendous effort made to educate the troops about their obligations when they're on deployment. But it's, of course, an ongoing effort. Why can't there be a tremendous effort to just disband the UN since it's been hurting so many people? Well, I actually would disagree. I think the UN does a tremendous amount of good. It doesn't cost as much as some programs, I'll give it that, in terms of US tax dollars. Um, but what did you do from your position to try and limit the use of uh, troops to hurt people, you know, well, sex abuse? I worked for the refugee agency, so mm -hmm. I was not involved with peacekeeping at all. And the UN Refugee Agency is a humanitarian agency that works to bring assistance to refugees around the world, of which there are many, many, many millions. Okay, not everybody answers my questions, but you gave it a shot, and I do okay. appreciate that. You're welcome. You take care, Dr. Thanks. Kuman. Hi, I'm Dave Ridley with RidleyReport.com. I'm sorry, I don't have much of a hand to shake, okay. but if you want to shake my hand, you can. No, no, that's fine. <laughs> We've told you before you cannot come. You're free to come. This is free to the um, public. So yeah, have I gone in there? You're welcome to come in. You can ask questions. I'm sorry. Go ahead, ma'am. Don't yeah. let us, don't let us show you down. Uh, have, I, have I gone in there? Uh, no, you haven't. So okay. what I'm saying is you can't film even from the outside. But how do I even know who you are? I mean, I don't even know what organization you represent, whether you have any I'm power. I'm university. Okay, okay I see. Here, okay? So, so let me tell you that you're free to come in, mm -hmm. okay? But the camera has to stay outside. Mm -hmm. The camera cannot be in there. So now, you are you censoring me, or is the World Affairs you Council? Understand? Are you censoring me, you or is the World Affairs saying? Council censoring me? No one's censoring you. You're free to come in and listen to the event. And I cannot really operate well. a video camera in there. That's you're what you're human, saying. You're a human. You have eyes. You can experience the event with your eyes, like everyone You else. are engaging in censorship. Who are? What's your name? Excuse me. I'm Herb Tensa. I'm Vice President of the World Affairs Council. Okay. Apparently, there's a problem. What's your problem? I would like to be able to videotape in there. Are you saying that I can't or can? Uh, do you have permission from the University of New Hampshire? Well, this is, you've rented this facility. You represent the university. Do you have a problem with the government in there, I mean, it's, is it open to the public? It's RidleyReport.com. It's a four man's TV station. Uh, oh, correct. <laughs> oh, it's, up, it's up to the university. It's up to the university. No, actually, the actually, the World Affairs Council has allowed reporting, and so has the university many times. I really don't understand your problem. I want to record what's going on in there. And you're trying to stop me. Why? No, I'm not trying to stop you. Okay, so are you saying that I can record in there? I have no authority to allow you in. Do you have the authority to it's, stop it's, me? It is the university. This is University of New Hampshire, Manchester property. Right, and I'm allowed and to it is, up, it is up to them. Okay, and so until, one, until someone from the university tells me to stop, which she just did, I would be free to go in there. Is that correct? Yes, you know, I mean, you know, I, I learned a long time ago, if a guy's got a pistol, I don't argue with him. So say sir to him and be nice. Sir to who? Who are you referring to exactly? Who's got a pistol? What are you talking about? You got a problem. I really don't know what it is, but I'm going to go in and see the program and good luck to you. Okay. Take care. Give me a moment. All right, thanks. <laughs> You can come.
come in as a private citizen, you can come in without the recording device. Do you understand me? The Am I required to answer your question? You're not answering most of mine. Hired. We've hired someone to mm -hmm. take film, okay? If I see you in there with the camera, you're out. But if I see you without the camera, you're very welcome to come in. Do you understand? Thank you. What's your name? She doesn't have to tell you my mom what her name is. Oh, okay. Who are you? I am Marilyn Monroe. Okay, thank you. Oh, well, at least you got a sense of humor. I don't you like to give out my name to public. It's All right. Just, and you wouldn't understand it anyways. It's a foreign name. Yeah, you can do that, and I can ask. Okay. I'll just give you a All right. Are we good to go? We're good. Wait, is it starting? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, take care, ladies. This Ridley O sponsored by friends of BitcoinStore.com. Half a million items for sale, often cheaper than Amazon. The easiest way to convert your bitcoins into real world stuff. They're privacy friendly, you don't even have to give your name. BitcoinStore.com.